greeting you all in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Father Constantinos Arius, the director, St. Irene's Orthodox Mission Center. Uh, today is a great and a joyous day that uh, we have never seen actually. It is a new dawn in our mission center of St. Irene's because we have uh, just uh, laid the, the cornerstone for the, our dormitory and uh, it has been a prayer or a long time prayer uh, since we started our mission center in the year 2010 uh, our kids have been uh, uh, sleeping in pathetic uh, uh, dormitories with openings made of wood semi-permanent but today we would say our prayers ha has been answered because we have laid the foundation here. As uh, you could see behind me, our St. Irene's Orthodox Mission Center kids also witnessing uh, this blessing. We would want to pass gratitude unto you for your continued support and for making our dreams uh, uh, come true. Because during Easter, when we celebrate the resurrection of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, indeed we shall have something to celebrate. Because in the near future, within one month, we shall have uh, these uh, two dormitories complete and uh, we shall move on to the other side to build more others. God bless you for your continued support. I'm saying this because beside me here, I'm starting with the contractor himself who is uh, responsible uh, for this uh, structure. And uh, you could see far over there, there is a church. He has helped us also to build the church there. And you could see it has a good roof. So we have a good and a great hope that we shall have amazing uh, structure here. And uh, we invite you to come over and witness as well this uh, blessing uh, that has come from God and through you. God bless you. We might not have something to offer you to compensate with this uh, miracle that you have brought, but we shall keep you in our prayers. We shall always remember you, even during the divine liturgy. God bless you and live many years. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you. O oh Lord, save your people and bless your inheritance, granting unto our rulers victories over foreigners.